Okay, I've got your two masks by 3M. Um, the 3M Advanced Filtering Face Mask is comes in white, and uh, it, it seals the best for me out of the box because it's got a very firm nose wire that grabs well, and it also has foam on the inside. It's actually sewn into a pocket here. Uh, you can see the foam. It's actually in the same pocket as the nose wire. They're uh, kind of intermingled in the same pocket, and... Um, so I like that, but it's a little bit expensive, and it comes in white, and I actually kind of like the idea of black these days when people are moving away from masks. They don't want to stand out as much. So 3M also sells this KF94 that you can get through G-Market, which is not quite ex expensive, and it does come in black, but unfortunately the nose wire in this 3M KF94 is not quite as strong as the nose wire in this uh, 3M AFFM. And, uh, but you can fix that by replacing the nose wire in the KF94 with, I call it the 18 gauge flat craft aluminum wire that you can get from Big Lots or from Amazon. <clears throat> and that's roughly the same as you'd find in this anti-advanced uh, filtering face mask from 3M. It's very strong. And uh, it's, so I've showed before how to, um, you know, change the nose wire. There's a little bit of a, a wrinkle for the this KF94 that the nose wire is in the same pocket as the foam. So you have to be careful to avoid damaging the foam in the process. And the, the real trick to that, two things. One is you're going to sand the front edge of the uh, of this wire so that when you insert it, there's nothing that's going to catch. Hopefully. <laughs> in fact, I think I'm just going to cut off this, uh, this damaged part in the front and start fresh. I'm going to sand basically every every direction on the corners of this edge so that there's nothing sharp to catch. That's step one is sand off the front edge. Okay, and then step two is I'm going to bend the, the what I call the front edge is the edge that I'm going to insert into the pocket bend it up a little bit so that as I insert it it's going to bend away f from the foam below it and it has no chance of catching in there. So that's the only difference uh, for doing it here, uh, the, the steps that you would take to preventing uh, damaging the nose wire. So then I'll just proceed as I did in my other video, move the nose wire to the end so I have something to uh, push against when I cut. And the rest, uh, that's really it. The rest of this video is just me fumbling through this. So we'll see how I do. Right. It's a little bit dark in here. I can't exactly see what I'm doing as well. Um, but uh, let's see how we do. All right, there's my cut. Let's see if I can get it out. Uh, yeah, there we go. So the nose wire that comes out, it's this white, it's kind of white flimsy plastic. It's nowhere near as stiff as this uh, aluminum. And uh, so that explains this. This, this uh, KF94 definitely does not seal as well. And it's this flimsy no nose wire that's to blame. So now, as far as the length of the replacement, I'm going to make it... Uh, I'm not going to measure it precisely. I'm going to make it a little bit longer than required and then trim it when I'm all done. Then I'm actually going to I'm just flatten this out a little bit uh, before I get started. Uh, let me see if I can just flatten it out in all directions so it's a little bit more well behaved. All right, and then, okay, I did my, have my, uh, this was a smooth end, sanded end, I'm, my, my sled shape back in there, a little bit tilted up. And sometimes I use the old nose wire as a guide to help me get in there. Just get my new one started, then pull my old one out. And now, now the rest is just pushing it in, and it goes in. Pretty darn easy. It, it, it's, I say it's very easy to get hooked, uh, caught up in the foam if you didn't put that little sled in there, but this one went in there real easy. And now I just need to cut off this extra 
So I bend it to mark my place, slide it back a little bit, cut it off, slide it back, now we're done. Uh, that's pretty well it. There we go. Now we have the black 3M with the stronger nose wire, just as good as the, uh, the anti-advanced filtering face mask, but it's black and it's cheaper. And uh, there you go. That's about it.